Mother threw me out. She threw a jar of mentholatum at me. <laughs> the family size. Well, it sounds like she's got her equilibrium back. Oh, what am I gonna do? Where am I gonna stay? <laughs> now, you are, Kim. What have you done to my icebox? Well, it just cried out for reorganization. You see what I've done? As I've arranged your condiments in alphabetical order, from A1 to Worcestershire. <laughs> <laughs> well, how the hell did you put away the lunch meat? By Dewey Decimal System? <laughs> All right. Commence fire. Aren't we hungry tonight? You see, Thelma, what eager eaters you get when you have a well-run kitchen? Well, I'm not going to be able to eat a bite off of this chipped plate. What, well, tiny little chip? Well, it's hardly noticeable. She's right. It's nothing compared to this fork. Have you ever seen anything that filthy? Well, for heaven's sakes, it's just a water spot. Oh, my God. Everybody check your flatware. <laughs> <laughs> well... Perhaps we should eat before everything gets cold. Shall I pour the tea? Oh, uh, not for me. I'll have a beer. Milk. Gatorade. Coke. <laughs> Fine. We'll be right back. Ooh, this meat looks overcooked. Except for the part that's bloody yuck. <laughs> now, now, stop your complaining. I'm sure it doesn't taste near as bad as it looks. It couldn't be as bad as it looked. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, heat up these buns, would you, I? They're stone cold. No problem. I have warm ones in the oven. More of those things? My, weren't you the optimist? <laughs> I want the classic Coke, not a diet. Fine. It's your waistline. <laughs> Carrots taste rotten. <laughs> Nonsense. The carrots are fine. It's just the rotten way Iola cooks them. <laughs> Coke. <laughs> Buns. Well, Iola, you're making me nervous. Will you please sit down? Yeah, I take a load off. Could you get me some ketchup first? <laughs> You're right, Bubba. This shoe leather could use something. I'd like some mustard. Gray poupon if you've got it. Make mine Mexi Pep. Oh, and uh, don't forget the horseradish. That covers up a multitude of sins. <laughs> problem in there, Iola. I thought those were alphabetized. <laughs> Here they are. I've also brought soy sauce, just in case. <laughs> I'll uh, forget it. I think this meal is a lost cause. Let's say we send out for pizza. Good idea. Yeah, make an extra large. I'm starved. Yeah, me too. You like the anchovies, Iola? <laughs> that does it. I am going home. I have never been treated this shamelessly in my life, not even by mother. Vincent, <laughs> Iola, maybe it is a good idea for us to take a breather from one another until the cruise. Oh, surely you jest. I wouldn't go on that cruise with you now if you were the last single on Earth. <laughs> After all I have done for you? Well, you're going to pay for that deposit, Missy. Gladly. And I'll pay for the tickets, too, because I am taking Mother. Mother? Yes. <laughs> She's always wanted to go on the Dixie Bale. This will be our reconciliation cruise. I'll send Daddy for my things. Including my slipcovers. Well, fine by me, because with you gone, they're the ugliest things in the room. <laughs> Way to go, Miss Harper. You've sent Iola back to her mother where she belongs. Yep. Plan B sure did the trick. Well, it tricked me right out of my crew. <laughs> yeah, but I bet the Dixie Belle doesn't have food this good. Isn't it fabulous? Hey, don't take all the carrots. Come on, Mama. Dig in before it's all gone. I was so looking forward to sitting at the captain's table. Here I am, stuck eating in the bilge with the water rats. 